The following triple threat contest is a no disqualifications match. Making her way to the ring from Camelot, the princess, Cinda. Guys, this sold out arena is buzzing right now in anticipation of this triple threat match. Yeah, and I'm willing to bet the concession stands are on empty right now. Nobody wants to miss even a second of this match. And I'd say these women definitely look ready to get this one started. So am I, Michael. I don't think I've ever seen these women. And her opponents, first, from Glasgow, Scotland, the Queen. Go, get up. Well, to say she looks ready to go here might just be an understatement. Yeah, Cole, she's been looking forward to this one like this crowd has been, too. From San Diego, California, Rude Paul, the Queen. Three big names set to do battle here tonight, guys, in this triple threat match. You're right, Michael. It doesn't get much bigger than this. And judging from the crowd reaction, they completely agree with us. Determined looks on these faces of these women for sure. Wouldn't you agree, Byron? Absolutely, but that shouldn't come as any surprise, especially considering how intense the women's division is right now. And here we go with this triple threat match. A lot of times the smart move in a match like this is to sit back in the weeds. Let the other two superstars tear each other apart. Let's see if we get any of that here tonight. Brian, I'd say the last time this city had a buzz like this when Ric Flair defended the WWE Championship against Randy Savage at WrestleMania 8. She got all that, Bulldog. And she strikes with great precision. That's how you slam an opponent down with authority. I see where she's going with this. Jeez. Zinda starting to look a little uneasy. She's got to be careful this doesn't turn into a two-on-one assault. Yeah, but I wouldn't count her out yet. Any one of these three women can win this match. And you could tell that this crowd is shocked to see her losing in such a definitive manner right now. And there's a slap. Oh, well, that's just humiliating.
There's a drop kick. Nice move. Got to wonder how this is going to end, Byron. Whatever happens, it's not going to be good. I can tell you that. Acrobatic maneuvers like that require special type of skills. She's taking on some offense here, but you certainly cannot count her out yet. Not surprising, Cole. When you're in the ring with two of the best women on the roster, you're going to take a few lumps. That's just the way it is. She's in a bad way here. Bottom line, she's got to get up. She can't win this match on her back. Oh, man, she's rolling now. We know what's coming here. She comes up with a slam. She has got to take advantage here. Will this be enough? And a kick out at two and a half. Might have slipped there, Cole. Well executed drop kick. She's in control. She's calling for it. She might have it. Oh, what incredible power. Wow, what a vertical suplex. No doubt about that one. That slam just brought this entire arena to its feet. She's absorbing some offense here. She might want to think about taking a breather and letting the other two women go at it for a while. Yeah, but I wouldn't count her out yet. Any one of these three women can win this match. Zinda not in a very good spot right now. Momentum clearly not on her side right now, fellas. Well, a triple threat is a match of strategy, but I'm not so sure... Looks like she wants to beat her inside the ring. She's looking at it early. Here she goes, back in the ring now. And she kicks out with relative ease. Hey, I guess you never know. We may be looking at a power bomb here. That's exactly what it looks like to me, Cole. She's going for the cover. One, two, and this has got to be it. Well done. She lands the belly to back. Crushing force on that elbow drop. Fighting to get back to her feet here. She's just taking too long, Cole. She's got to move faster. We're looking at complete domination here. This might be it. Oh, what a slam! Landed him. She can pick up the win here, guys. Can she do it here? Shoulder got up, but I don't think it was in time. Come on, ref. Finish the count. She saw the opening and got the shoulder up. You can see the confidence just beaming from her right now. And she lands the slam. That might have done it, Cole. She's got the shoulders down. Two. Wait, are we sure that that wasn't three? Very nice. I think we're at the point in this match where the finisher could be used at any moment here. Zinda with his back against the wall here. She may not even know where she is, leaving her incredibly vulnerable here in this triple threat match. She's clearly out of her element here in this triple threat match. Don't be surprised if one of these women put her up. It could be over here. Barely at two and a half. She's not done yet, but you have to believe that she's still in all sorts of trouble here. And now she's on the offensive. And she comes up with a big counter. She is on fire. She's taking a while to recover here, guys. At this point, she needs a new game plan.
Her overhand punch finds the mark. Ah, oh, the strength. This should do it right there. The resolve this woman is showing right now is absolutely unreal. Can you believe this? Oh, and she has an answer for that one. And there's the counter. She's on a roll now. You'd have to think hitting the finisher here could end this. Thing. Look at that, she escapes. Talk about coming up clutch, guys. Wow, she's acrobatic. That's never a bad thing. Well, unless you're her opponent. Back in the ring now. These superstars wearing the wounds right now of what has been an absolutely thrilling matchup. She wants it one more time. Vertical suplex. Nice. That should do it. I don't believe it. This one is over. Here is your winner, RuPaul, the Queen. And she gets the job done. Very important her being that much better than the other two on this given night. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining us. That was quite a triple threat match we just saw.